The opinions expressed in the video you are about to see are solely those of Boatest.com and its test captain. Captain Steve for Boatest.com and this is the Yamaha SX210. It's the entry level boat in the Yamaha lineup. Short on price but not short on features. Let's take a look at what you get. The fun starts right at the stern with this trademark Yamaha transom. Everybody tries to duplicate it, but nobody really gets it right because Yamaha doesn't have to build it around an engine box. You've got a great comfortable seating area, fun to watch the action in the water. You've got a base for your pedestal table and a remote control for your stereo. At the heart of the SX210, a pair of 1052cc four-cylinder four-stroke Yamaha engines. Stepping into the cockpit, We've got an aft-facing lounger that joins a wraparound seat, distance between the seats, full 38 inches, nice cockpit table, snap-in carpet, from the seat base to the height of the seat back, another 18 inches. And I like that you have glove box storage over on the port side here. At the helm, we've got a nice captain seat with a flip-up bolster. Gauges are all laid out nicely. Speedometer in the middle, RPM to both sides, fuel to the right, depth gauge to the left. Rocker switches with circuit breakers next to them. And this boat also has a no wake mode. Bring your throttles up to the idle position, activate the no wake mode, and now you're able to keep the speed controlled without having to continually keep adjusting the throttles. To disengage, move the throttles or re-engage the switches one more time. I like that there's a stereo right at the helm instead of a remote control. Two cup holders to my side. I like that there's two cup holders because one inevitably gets used for filling up with stuff, your glasses, a radio, suntan lotion. One can also be used for holding beverages. Stainless steel supports holding the windshield. Easily strong enough to hold my 170 pound weight without flexing at all. There's storage to the port side. And as you open the door all the way, it'll block the wind for operating on those cool days. The stole storage has a cooler here, a second cooler, and of course either one can be used for holding life jackets, throwable device, whatever you may have. There's standard storage underneath both seats. Distance between the seats at the stern is 24 and a half inches. As you move to the bow, it drops down to 17 and a half inches. Height from the deck, 17 and a half inches. And from the base of your seat to the windshield, 17 and a half inches. And measuring all the way from the forward part of the seat to the aft, 46 inches, which is plenty of room to sit down, stretch out your legs. And we have a nice filler cushion. It goes in place to make a sun pad out of the whole bow area. All the way at the bow, you've got convenient storage for your anchor and an anchor line, and also a three-step boarding ladder. The SX210 by Yamaha. It may be an entry-level boat, but it is not short on features. Everything that you saw me point out is included in this package as standard, as well as the painted trailer with swing-away tongue. For BoatTest.com, I'm Captain Steve. We'll see you on the water.